Hi, <clears throat> hey everybody. Gabe Suarez here. Um, so, um, one of my one of my students recently sent me a video uh, by uh, Ken Hackathorn, um, where he basically was saying that you don't need a red dot site. Um, and <clears throat> you know, he um, he made some statements on the video that um, I disagree with. Um, now, in the beginning, uh, Ken made a note saying that uh, when he said that you don't need a red dot site, that uh, I believe he called them nipple heads. <laughs> what a great term. I'd never heard of that one before. I've called people propeller heads, but nipple heads? <clears throat> anyway, Ken said that these guys came out of the woodwork and were, you know, accusing him of being a... Uh, you know, out of touch and uh, all sorts of things. Um, unfortunately, that is uh, kind of part and parcel of our day and age where uh, people cannot disagree um, without trying to somehow denigrate the other party. Uh, that's not what this rebuttal is going to be about. Um, I respect Mr. Hackathorn uh, completely. Um, you know, he's been around forever. Uh, uh, you know, contemporary of, of gentlemen like uh, Farnham, Taylor, uh, and others. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, so please, Mr. Hackathorn, don't believe that I'm in any way disrespecting you. Uh, I'd be more than honored to show you what we have discovered in, in terms of the, uh, the red dot systems uh, at any time. Um, but, uh, you know, I, I think, uh, I think you, you, you've made a few... Uh, I think misunderstandings about what what this is all about. Okay, now uh, Ken seems to be um, in the video dismissing anything other than an iron sighted 1911 carried in a leather summer special on the strong side. Um, you know that may have been state of the art at one time, but you know it's not it's not anymore today. Uh, not that. 